Hello and welcome back for my Python tutorials. In uh, in this tutorial, I will show what uh, Falcon is. It's a REST API for Python. It's very easy to use, and it can handle a lot of requests each second if you build your application right. So first, you need to go for the terminal, and then we should install Falcon. To be sure, it's, it's installed. Then. Uh, type pipe install falcon i'm already have a, a falcon on my machine so to to test a falcon application i'm personally use gunicon so that's what i want to uh, install when you have uh, this part installed we are ready to move to the next step go for your editor and be sure you have both uh, json and falcon enabled when we uh, have falcon and json imported we should make a class we can call it the uh, object uh, request class just for a sample and then we need a listener like if you make a request uh, as a get method let's say get uh, so on get we need the uh, ourselves and the request and the response right now if we just uh, say x and we no so not run it in yet and we want to prepare it's working then we need to tell it's a api falcon api and then api add root and we want to listen on test slash test and then we want our class to tell what happened here it's meaning if you make a request slash test it will uh, depends on what you do like get or delete or post or put or something like that it will listen in inside the our classes so let's go in for for testing this so we go for the terminal we type gunicorn and then the file and api my file name is uh, app you can see app the, uh, the pu and then <coughs> my uh, internal classes here is the api so that's why i'm use uh, gunicorn on the application app uh, api and now the gunicorn has started for test and you can see it's a local host on port 8000 now i will will open my rest client great yeah we want to open And here we go. Sorry for the delay. And we want a get request, and it's uh, eight thousand slash test. Then you can see nothing, but in the terminal you can see aches. What we want now is it's when you request something, you need to return something to the client. In this case, we go back for, for our editor and we want to change the body uh, we, we returned. So the way to do it is it's like we need to a uh, content variable. You can call it whatever you want and then do a simple directory. We want to call it um, name and my name is Paris and uh, age I'm 31 and country I'm from Denmark and and I, now I'm I wish I can return it back to the client and the way we do it is to say the response body should be changed to or JSON to a JSON object 
when we, we convert a directory to a JSON object. So now it's the content. We save it, we kill the, the unicorn and restart it again. And then we simply say send again. So now we can see the country is Denmark. It's right, my age is 31 and my name is Paris. Thank you for watching this tutorial. I hope you enjoy. If you have any question, please make a comment below. I will continue this uh, tutorial in the next movie. I hope you like it and I hope you want to follow my channel. See you next time.